all about my money, get my guap and talk my uh, Higher than a bitch, I'm off the oil, they don't get it uh, Running up my money, I'm getting my money, I'm talking my chicken huh? <laughs> Bitch be talking that shit, but whole time told that bitch to listen huh? Running up this shit, but whole time ain't no competition huh? What's cracking y'all, what's cracking y'all, what's cracking y'all Alright man, you already know what's going on, it's your boy Mr. Sensi, you feel me, you chillin' Already rolled up, you feel me, gotta be the smooth ones, gotta be the smooth ones This is the other one that's gonna put me to sleep too, but it's a cool one Since I'm here with y'all, I actually wasn't gonna take another shot But, we gonna take a shot for y'all real quick, you know what I'm saying It's 4.35 in the morning, you know what I'm saying, I should be asleep I don't know what it's been, but lately I've been staying up late as hell Just really, you know what I'm saying, brainstorming with myself, chopping it up with myself, stuff like that You know, I'm just chilling, vibing, all of that good stuff, so I'm like, shit, what could we talk about? Because I low-key got to upload a vlog, and this ain't even going to be uploaded in time, but it's going to be uploaded today for sure. Or, I think I got some other videos on here on the same SD, so I don't know, but it's going to be uploaded, you know what I'm sometime this week, if it's not today. But, let me take this shot real quick. <laughs> even out <laughs> that shit was like it started hitting me cause I had smoked earlier bro that shit was hitting me and I think in the shower and I didn't want to get a shower and be spinning this shit so I was like I gotta kinda mellow out then when I came back in I was kinda coming down to like the end of my drunk so then it was kinda like having like this little weird ass little feeling but then we cool now and shit so I was like fuck it so, we finna talk about the whole Southside G Herbo and Funny Marco situation real quick, you know what I'm saying? I only got 40 minutes left on this SD, so we gonna try to make it slick and quick. Anyway, you feel me? A lot of people was getting on there, you know what I'm saying? They stating their opinions from Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, everywhere, you know what I'm saying? Facebook as well. And I feel like, let me spark this real quick. So, a lot of people leaving their opinions and shit on the video, you know what I'm saying, on all the socials and everything, you know what I'm saying, how they feel. Some people feel like it's funny, some people feel like it's not. It's like, I'll be, I'll be real with y'all, majority of people don't think that shit funny. Like, her upset a lot of people, and he kind of probably made a lot of people look at his ass different after that. I don't know if he care. I ain't gonna say he shouldn't care, because it's like, whatever, you know what I'm saying? But... It's motherfuckers, I guess. Some of the people probably was people that didn't really fuck with her. And after that, just was like, yeah, bro, I ain't gonna lie. You kind of, like, lame as hell for that shit, gang. Like, I, mean, I can't even fuck with you after this. Because it's like, what the fuck? Like, and I'm gonna be real with y'all. The next video after this, what I should do, because I done turned the, turn the video on, like, Three, four times while I done started it, like, four times. Started over today. But didn't watch it past, well, like, two minutes because I was busy doing shit. So I'm like, I'll fuck around and just get up on here, turn it on, and react to it myself. And tell y'all how I feel. Because I only just seen clips and snippets, so it'll be good, fresh, and it'll be a honest opinion. You know what I'm saying? Coming straight off the dome and shit like that, like. It ain't gonna be no scripted. It's gonna, of course, it's gonna be pre recorded because it's all pre recorded, but it ain't, it's gonna be fresh. Oh, I did, but I can just miss that. I feel like I probably gotta take this. I, it, I it'd be like that. Bro. I don't know why. Yeah, and that's how I just did it too. I'm gonna go smooth to sleep after this. But, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to do that reaction on there. But, anyway, though, so, from the clips and the snippets and shit that I've seen right now, all on the social, that's floating. Uh, and Hennessy. 
with all the clips floating around and all of that, right? I'm like, with all that shit I've been seeing, I'm like, okay. At first, when I first seen it, right, I'm going to be real with y'all. I ain't even, I was just on some, like, everybody else. I'm oh, shit. Her was on Funny Marco. I need to see that shit. I need to watch that shit. Same way I felt when he went with Kai and shit. I'm like, you know what I'm saying? Let me see how you be and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, how you acting, how you, how you is, you know? I get on, I get on, I get on line. Well, I'm tweaking. That's what I think when I see it when I'm online for the first time, but I don't think nothing deep of it. I get back, I get back on social media again. Now I'm starting to see the clips surface. Actually, I think this was like now it's been two days since that shit happened or since it's posted or whatever. So I'm getting there two days late. But motherfuckers, instantly I'm seeing I get back on social media like today or whatever. Now I'm seeing everybody like, I'm seeing the clips resurface again, but people actually leaving their opinions and I'm reading the opinions and shit in the comments and I'm reading like the preview comments on like Instagram and show you like the one preview comment and shit. And what got my attention was somebody was like, I ain't gonna lie. He was doing way too motherfucking much. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he was being lame as hell. Like, that shit wasn't even cool. Like, you know what I'm saying? He ain't even, they ain't even let you do your show. And I'm like, damn. I'm like, her, what you do to where motherfuckers call me lame, gang? I'm like, I hope you ain't going that man show and disrespect him like that. You know what I'm saying? Because that'd be foul. Then what made me also, you know what I'm saying, piece of shit is her posted the uh, clip or whatever from it and shit like that. And he was like, Marco, Marco really like my uh, long lost twin or some shit. People comments and telling her like, shit, well, you think you feel otherwise? And to be honest, like, from what he posting, the clips he posting, the comments he leaving on shit, we I mean, don't think he feel like that. We kind of feel like, bro, kind of don't like how y'all came on this show. He kind of he don't fuck with. Ain't no kind of he don't fuck with it. He just not speaking loudly about it. But you got people sitting there like, why well, ain't he speaking loudly? He's making complaints on the social media that he has millions of followers on and hella fans. So he's making a complaint. But the thing is, a lot you got a lot of people sitting here getting on his ass like, bro, you black. You should have spoke up when that shit was taking place. I'm like, shit. They kind of right, but when you got a reputation to keep on your show, it's more important for you to stay professional versus stoop down to their level. So that's what he, was, he did, you know what I'm saying? He kept it professional. He kept it Marco. But like, at the end of the day, you know, we ain't gonna, we ain't, we ain't gotta jump basically straight to gestures and be like, that nigga soft, he basically a bitch and all this because he's making these complaints but didn't say shit when the niggas was, the niggas was on the show disrespecting him. But it's like, he's not supposed to. One, at the end of the day, all publicity is good publicity. So, even if He's sitting on this show and it look like he's getting extorted. You know what I'm saying? Made fun of, punked, bullied. He posted and it's a celebrity that people know and fuck with. Rather, it's bad for their image or good. He's gonna post it because they came on the show and knew what the fuck they were doing. 
all right, y'all want to come on the show and act like this. I'm going to post it still regardless, you know what I'm saying? Y'all came on here, y'all showed y'all last. I'm going to get that, I'm going to get y'all that, you know what I'm saying? Y'all showed the fuck out, like, you know, low-key had me on this bitch stuck. I'm like, damn. These niggas low-key came on this bitch to clown. Like, it's cool, you know what I'm saying? I ain't tripping. But it's like, okay, I peep. So, fuck it, since that's what we doing, I'm going to let y'all niggas do that. You know, I ain't going to trip about it. I ain't going to be mad about it. But... For a motherfucker to get on my show, call me all types of dumbasses and all of this shit, it's like, damn, gang. What did I do to you? You know what I'm saying? Like, what have I did to insult you? You get on my shit. Yo man's was on my shit before you got here, right? He was a totally different person. You get here. It's like he put on this whole different outfit. And he turns into like a cheerleader or something. That's how they feel. That's what a lot of people say. And he probably felt like that, like. So I was like, when you was on here the first like five, five, seven, ten minutes, whatever, by yourself. You don't do that, bro, because you was chilling. Then Herb get on this bitch. He come tweaking. Here you go, co-signing the tweakage. Motherfuckers like, man, I ain't gonna lie, bro. That shit was lame. The only clip that I really keep seeing is the one when he counted like 15 bands or something. And like, <coughs> when I seen that clip, that was the first clip I seen when I hopped on the internet a few days ago. I'm not knowing there's bullshit behind this whole video. Leave it to the net. They gonna let it be known. So everybody get the comments and letting them know, leaving their opinions, all that. I'm like, damn, bro, you kinda, you probably really fucked up with this. This man, this man has millions of supporters just like you. Has a damn near the same amount of supporters as you, bro, with this funny shit. The Instagrams and Facebooks have like the same amount of followers down there. This man post this and you eat him up, disrespect him. It's just like damn near like somebody getting on Bobby show and damn near oh, they, someone feel like she's overly disrespected or something. I feel like, uh, uh, we don't like that. We don't like how y'all, how, how that person came on there and was disrespecting you like that. That's how it is with them. That's how they feeling with Marco. This is best me though. Oh God. I think I put too much wax in it. This bitch should have smoked low key harder. I don't smoke another one either at no point. But, like I said, you know what I'm saying? With that whole situation, from the clips I've seen, you know, to leave my opinion real quick before I go and view the video and do my little review or whatever, I'm going to say this. Motherfuckers low-key got it was, ready for what I see. I seen a clip where they threw my man's watching some more shit, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, damn. What's that about? You know what I'm saying? Like, why I throw the man watch? He said he paid 30K for that watch. The other day felt like it was floozy, phony, not good enough on the quality, whatever. It's like, bro, you don't have the, you don't have the, you shouldn't have the audacity to feel like you can break somebody's shit. That they worked hard and paid for it. The fuck you want? What if I snatch your wrist? What if I snatch your watch off your wrist? Snatch your chain? I break your shit in your face. I'm expecting you want to bomb about it, bro. 
But since you on my show, I gotta keep it kosher. So I gotta just be like, damn. Okay. I wanna tweak Lil' Kim, probably show my ass, but you know, y'all got it. And remember, most of us don't know that, man. Just to hear feel like you got bitch. He went he went about it like a hoe or anything because like at the end of the day you got a career to keep. Just like her. Just like motherfucking Southside. So I feel like they should have got on there and been a little bit more professional with my nigga, you know what I'm saying? You could have went and fucked with him and trolled him, but you don't have to troll him how you did it. It was kinda like it was kinda overboard. From what I'm seeing, but I'm gonna go watch the shit and I'm gonna leave my actual full opinion on the video while I'm watching it. You know what I'm saying? And we gonna get that shit rocking, but I'm finna take my ass to sleep, so y'all already know what the fuck going on. It's your boy, Mr. City. Press that subscribe button, keep the mask coming, I'm gonna get out with y'all. It's Erskine. I'm off the oil, they don't get it, uh Running up my money, I'm getting my money I'm talking my chicken, hold up, bitch Be talking that shit, but her time told that bitch to listen